Hi all, it's Anna, and today we are back with a little to the left, but we're doing their cupboards and drawers DLC. We can start from the beginning. For those that don't know, a little to the left is a very cute, relaxing puzzle game where you organize various trinkets and items as you progress through each level, and occasionally there's a mischievous little cat that kind of messes with the flow of things. And yeah, let's check it out. So we are sorting our clocks. Oh no, you know what? Would these fit here? Yeah, there we go. And then this one up there. So the square ones probably go in the square shaped cupboards. Oh, it makes a little triangle. How cool. Uh, these look like they will make a square. Cool. Yay, first puzzle done. Awesome. Oh no. It's a little <laughs> art drawer. Oh, we have so much stuff. Okay, let's get everything out. I'm in googly eye. Let's put this up here. What do we have in this one? More stuff. Hmm. Oh, this googly eye's moving around. Okay, um, we have all of these. Can we get rid of them now? <laughs> Can't throw them off the screen. Okay, let me put everything up here so that I can reach it to it as need be. Okay, so we can open you. <laughs> Look, we organized it. Oh no, there's one more. Grab it. There we go. Okay, so the paint brushes might go here. Yeah, because they fit in really nicely. And then, do we have one more? Ooh, already looks 50 times better. So we have these paints. Be down here. Um, hmm, we only have four of them, so maybe this drawer is too big. Well, we'll see. Okay, let's put the googly eye there, and then our little ink can go there. Highlighters. Not sure where to put our rubber bands. <laughs> oh, kind of. Maybe that one first, and this one. This seems organized. <laughs> And then our scissors look like they fit into here. No, we do have more paint. Nice. There we go. Kind of have a pattern going on. And then our little strings. Let's put you there. All right. Our custom built drawers hold everything. Do we need to put these too? I don't really know if we necessarily need to have those. <laughs> it's not finished. Hmm. Maybe it's like this. There's like a color gradient going on. Like that? Maybe? Not really? Okay. Um, what am I not getting? Maybe it's this. Do they like organize themselves in a specific way? No. Hmm. Do I close them? No, that wasn't it. <laughs> Maybe you go in the middle. Um, not quite sure where they go. Hmm. There's like something that's out of order, but I'm not sure what. I feel like these are fine. That looks good. Something about these pencil shavings. Do I just not need them in here? No. No, that's not it. What is this? I feel like it also should not be as complicated as I'm making it out to be. <laughs> I don't know. Um. All right, well, that figured itself out. All right, now we have some fountain pens or calligraphy pens. Let me just put them each in a little slot. Let's cap them. Mm, looks a little awkward now, but then that's probably correct. And then yellow with the yellow and black with black. And now I can focus on organizing them. Let's look for a pattern. What about these rings? Some of them have more, some of them have less. So one ring, two ring, three, four, five, six, and seven. Yay, that's done. Ooh, ooh, four ways. So you have different amounts of stars depending on how many different possible solutions there are for a level. So you can go back and try to figure out the other patterns that you can organize them in. Ooh, we have a little book. Oh, we're matching the flowers. Uh, there. You will go here. You go there. Mm, you don't seem to have a spot here. You go there. Okay, well, with 
most of these sorted, we can start looking at the flowers that are outside of here. Um, I feel like you go here. Ooh, yay. So there's one that goes here. It has little uh, thingies sticking out to the left, to the right. <laughs> Don't know my directions. So the white one goes here. You look like you belong here. Oh, they try to trick you. It's like broken in half or something. It goes there. You go here. It's a little flower I missed right here. Let's put you back in your spot. Oh, I missed a lot of little ones. <laughs> oh, that one's in space. Okay. I should have removed all of them or most of them. I don't have like a big flower to fit here. Maybe we'll have to like piece it together. Let's see which ones we do have. We have that one. We have this little guy. Mm, so we can piece them together. Okay. So then this one would probably go there with this one going there. This one. Oh, so we do get to use all of them. I thought some of them were going to be left behind. And then last but not least. Yay. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay. Well, well, well. I gotta figure this out. <laughs> kind of maybe stack the toilet paper together. That'll work for now. We only have one glove. Oh, candle. I feel like this should be up there. Your bucket can go... Oh, it has water in it. It's like sloshing around. <laughs> you know what? These two look like they fit nicely next to each other. And then the trash, the recycling bin. Ooh, yes, that fits nicely right there. These two came together. Oh, and it fits really nicely there. Excellent. And then you would go there. That looks good. Um, I feel like the toilet paper might benefit from being down here. Just because it's the only thing that looks like it fits snugly into this shelf. Good. And then, okay, that can stay there. Hmm. Yeah, you can go there. And then you go there. You can probably put the candle there. Ooh. And then you. <gasps> That's a hook. Yay. I like when everything has its place. And once you're done cleaning. Oh my goodness. What a cutie. Oh my gosh. Oh, you can turn the water on. I think. <laughs> I don't know if this is something we want to organize or just put right into the sink. All right, so we got the trays in. And we have peas, crackers, apples, broccoli, a sandwich. So let's put the sandwich here. A little half eaten. Okay. That looks like it goes together. Uh, <laughs> so random. We have crackers, all these broken crackers as well okay but these guys mm, mm, that doesn't look too good this is like eating broccoli it is okay i don't know where to put that for now let's put our celery sticks here yeah and then maybe you guys go in here you go here mm -mm -mm. okay we only have two apple slices so the apples go in the bot at uh, this circle one and then our little peas stay at the bottom not looking the best in terms of organization, but that's okay. And then these crackers. Let's figure them out. Um, <laughs> do they even go into this one? Doesn't look like they fit nicely. All right, maybe you guys go into here. Yeah, that looks better. And then the broken off pieces can be there. Um, the broccoli can go here. There we go. <gasps> Yay! Oh gosh, it's the tools again. It's always the tools that get me. Especially when you can rehang all of the ones that they already put up for you. All right, you look like you belong. Ooh, no. Do you? Yeah, that could work. Oh, yes, it's magnetic. Perfect. Um, You can be hung. So let's put all our knives up here so at least they're organized. Um, so we have a cleaver. Not the good spot for that. All right, let's put the knives up first. Or is the last one? right there so this one's the biggest so let's hang you up here Ooh, no trade them there we go that looks good um i feel like i want all the cutting tools to be in one area yeah, it doesn't look too good maybe here you know what maybe you do stay here and that one belongs on the floor for now that kind of fit more or less hanging something up there probably won't work that looks nice that fits in 
little curves. I don't know how I'm supposed to hang this, if this is supposed to like be on top of something, but I guess we'll see. Uh, it doesn't look too good, but it'll have to do. It looks a little bit more organized. And then you can go onto that one. Oh, how do I make this stick up there? Oh no, no, no. <laughs> it's precarious. Oh, that's not it. Okay. It looks like it works because everything fits. What if we switch these two? Oh, that already doesn't look nice. No, that looks wrong. Wasn't that what I just had? It didn't count the previous time. <laughs> Maybe I moved something over like a centimeter and it worked. Oh no, there are two. Okay, let's start with this one. This is like the kitchen junk drawer, isn't it? Oh, it didn't look like I can move the things from one drawer to another. Okay, well, start somewhere. You belong there. You're tiny. You can wait over there for your turn. You belong there. Not sure where you go. Can we stack these? Hold on. I must know. Oh, it's from a different set. That's a little corn, corn holder. I forgot what they're called. Ah, uh, little bendy straws. Don't doesn't look like they belong there necessarily. Ooh, I can move things between drawers. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, let's figure out what doesn't belong where. I feel like the ice cream scoop goes here. No, it doesn't. <gasps> I've been bamboozled. Okay, leave you there. Um, you look like you belong here. Where's my other friend? Okay, so it's you, you, and then you. You go there. This little straw can wait its turn. Up here? Yes. Um, do we feel like the straws go here? No, not really. Mm, let's put these little marbles over here. Or unless these are like little magnets. Who knows? Okay, that goes there. Let's get rid of the little ties. That looks okay right there. A little can opener. It's a little tiny spoon. Oh, that, it does go here. I just didn't notice it before. And then the big spoon goes into this drawer. Let's get into your place. You come here. Let's pull up the big measuring cup. I think they'll look good here. They at least fit here nicely. Um, This guy goes there. And there's one more tool that should go there. Oh, okay. That can go there. Where do I put the little packets of condiments? Right there. Is that mustard? I guess we'll never know. And then we have our crazy little ties that we have to figure out where they go as well. Uh, I'm assuming you guys go there. Up there. Where do I put my corn cob holders? I only have one. That's not good. Am I missing something? Do I have a third drawer? No. Where do I put these guys? Mm. Hmm. Okay, let's put the big things away. So the timer goes there. You, my friend, where would you go? Oh, you go here. And then... Our corn cob holder, the only one that we have, goes there. And then let's get the straws up here. Just bendy straws of various degree of bendiness. <laughs> um, let's see if we can fit. Oh no, that didn't look too good. You probably go here. There's some more room. What is the best way to get these guys to sit together like that? Kind of looks like it flows together. And then these guys go down here. Yay! Ooh, okay. A little, it's gonna say tea shelf. That's not what this is. A little tea corner. We gotta lid the teapot. Put down our cupcakes. What? We're missing two more. Oh, they're connected. That's so cute. All right, oh, one more cupcake. That can go there, I think. Seeing that's mint and then some sort of orangey, cinnamony tea, maybe? Whoa. Look at this thing, it's huge. Oh, it's for the teapot. Oh, it's so cute. They stack. Okay, maybe we can do it by size. So the biggest is this blueberry jam, then this strawberry jam and raspberry jam. Is that accurate information? Probably not. Oh, that's for the spoons. I want the spoons facing each other. Cute. And then we have our teacups. Just put this on top <laughs> to crush them. Mm, it doesn't really work, though. 
Okay, that looks like a better placement for that. Yeah, these two are like weirdly shaped so they can go together. Our honey pot could probably stay here. What if we add you here, put you... Uh, that doesn't work. You belong here. That is where you look the best. The cupcakes can be next to you. Now yeah, these guys. I feel like you belong somewhere there. <gasps> Yay! I'm like hyper focused on the outline of the shapes and how they fit together because that's what I learned from the actual game is that the outline matters you want everything to fit nice and smoothly between one another wow more of this <laughs> like this would fit perfectly somewhere like here or here and that kind of helps guide you if you're ever stuck trying to figure out where something goes uh, can I put you up here okay let's just figure out what we're working with we have more knives a little spatula Ooh, more pans they're probably gonna fall <laughs> okay let's move the knife for now i need a good place for this cutting board i mean that would actually work isn't this weirdly shaped okay ah everything's falling all right how many pans do we have looks like we have three pans mm, that might work Ooh, that looks good and then i want you to be hanging for now so i don't have to deal with you later until later Ain't this weirdly shaped too. Okay, um, let's hold off on that one. We have all these tools, these wrenches. Or no, maybe these are not wrenches. These are giant forks. I don't know where to put you. I also don't know where to put this frying. Ooh, that looks good. Yes, yes, yes. And then you go here. Perfect. I'm figuring it out slowly but surely. <laughs> um, you would probably be best right there. Yes, that works. This tiny little guy can go here. It's like a little scoop for something. Whatever this tool is can live there. And you are right there. Yay! Look at us getting organized. <laughs> oh dear, this is our pantry. Yep, that one is going there. So let's remove all of this. A little apple. Can we put them away? You can put the fruit in the little basket. Oh no, wait, this is just for apples. Maybe we'll find one for potatoes or whatever this is. This is a kiwi or a potato? Who knows? There we go, that goes together. Let's move our cans up here for now. Ooh, no, that doesn't work. <laughs> As I try 50 more times to put it in there. Um, oh, they stacked automatically. How convenient. Still don't know where to put them, so let's leave them off for now. This is perfect. We can put our corn in here and our other cans here. There we go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Corn, little fruit. Yep, apple, stop falling out. There you go. Where are my cans? There we go. Boom. And then we have one more empty shelf, probably for the salt. Put our extra salt in here. There we go. Yeah, you look best on this shelf. And we have all of these pots. Oh, maybe the tall one can go here and then it's tiny friends around it. Oh, we have four of these. Okay, so our fruits and our potatoes can be here. And then Probably the pasta is up here. Oh yeah, because it fits this little pattern going on here. So switch the spots of these two. That looks good. And then you can go here. No, on this side. Oh, no. There we go. Oh no, that's not it. Oh, you know what? Probably our stacks of cans. We'll go from the most cans to the least cans. Yay, perfect. Nice. Excuse me. Oh no not gonna drop it are you oh you are <laughs> you're so silly such a silly cat <laughs> they're like the right move is to pet your cat when they do something bad our cat is just slowly breaking things as we fix things or the cat is helping us get rid of unnecessary things like everything in this drawer looks unnecessary okay what are we working with we have pencils a glue stick, more pencils, baby pencils, ah, there we go, settle down. Okay, that looks good. Our screwdriver can go there. <gasps> no, my pencils are crushed. There we go. Uh, earplugs, I think. That's what those are. We need one more. Excellent, that goes there. I don't know why we have only five cards that we just hold it on to. <laughs> If it works, it works. Our lighter, a spare key. Go there for now. Oh no. Let's put our light bulbs in. 
excellent. An eraser. Hold off on that for now. This little weird stick can go there. Another key. Oh, they look nicer there. Our little stamps. The eraser. And then these two can go on either side of this. But then I need to shove that card back. There we go. Ooh. All right, I gotta organize our filing cabinet. Color coded, maybe. Let's do the green blank one in the back. Okay, so we have the green, the blue, the yellow, the red together. That does not look any more organized than it was before. We have a blank one of each. We have one with red. I wonder if you can organize this many different ways. Um, maybe let's do it by tabs. Yay! There's probably like, yeah, two other ways to do it. What is this? It's broken. Why would someone break this? <gasps> oh, there's more. Okay. Hmm. Well, let's get all the... Oh, these are fossils. Who broke our fossils? Okay, let's get all these in here. Let's start piecing it together. It looks like a fish. Yay! We did one! Our poor fossils. We broke them all. It's like a little snail shell. One more piece. Is it here? Oh, yes. Oh, it's just shaking at me. It's like, here I am. Take me. That's two. I feel like this one belongs there. Whatever that is can go there. It's like a flower. Oh, like little leaves. And then this looks like some kind of bug. Not a butterfly. Definitely not a butterfly. <laughs> like a little dragonfly almost. All right, and then these two. There we go. Oh, and then two more pieces. One in the middle, and there we go. We have little leaves. And then this one. Not quite sure what this is. Yes, that goes there. You go here. That looks like those go together, but not in that spot. There we go. That's looking much, much better. Is it like a snake or something? Oh yeah, it is a snake. Ah, how cool. We fixed our fossils. Woo. Just gotta cement them. Cement glue them together or something so they don't fall apart. Oh, that's so cute. That's so cute. I like little sounds it makes. Okay. So let's organize our gaming drawer. Our Rubik's Cubes, our games. Probably the shelf might fit them all. Hmm, that does not look good though, because there's still space. Hmm. A little bit better. Okay, let's do these guys. Yay, that works well. And then our controllers can probably go down here somewhere. Okay, this one probably goes there. That one goes there. There we go. It's more color coordinated. Um and then our controllers. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, so this is fine. This is fine. I don't know if we need to color coordinate these in some way. Maybe just a little bit. Semi better. This looks like it forms kind of like a pyramid almost. So move you here. You go next. No. Orange one. And then you. Move you down to the floor for now. There, that looks more organized. And I don't know. This doesn't seem to be making much of a difference. I don't know. Why did that work? You know, I won't question it. I'll just consider it good that it did. Oh my goodness. Wow. Just when you think it couldn't get more complicated, it does. All right, so I think the first thing would be, I'm assuming this is the game board at the top, so we might have to put it together. A little mountain, a little river. Okay, that corner looks good. That looks good. This doesn't look good. Let's leave that on the side for now. This looks like that belongs together, but it doesn't make sense for this to be the game board then. <laughs> that looks like it goes there. Need like a kite looking thing over there. Like that, but not really. There's some of this just does not look right at all. Does that look okay? Kind of does look fine. Yeah, and it's like the start and then the finish, maybe? Oh no, this would be the start and then it goes that way. That got figured out. <laughs> And we have all these miscellaneous bobs and pieces everywhere else. Ooh. <gasps> Yay, it goes together. Is that a gummy bear? It doesn't sound like a gummy bear. Although I don't know what a gummy bear would sound like. All right, so that goes there. There's like a little timer-shaped thing there. That's a little bow tie. Maybe the marbles go in here. And then we have all of these spots too. Oh my goodness, everything just phased through. I feel like these are the game pieces. So all the game pieces should be together. Even though this one doesn't fit. Okay, you can have that corner. 
you weirdly shaped thing. Mm, does not look right, but we'll take it for now. More dice. I don't know if this is a good spot for the dominoes. Does not look like it. We have this triangular cone. I don't know, some of these things are so random. Okay, what are we missing? I know we have like a bunch of extra pieces hiding around. There we go. Okay, maybe the dominoes do belong here. That looks like a good pattern to keep them in. Do I have any other things that I'm hiding somewhere? I do. Let's there we go. Zero, one, two, three, four, five. That looks perfectly fine to me. That does not belong there. You go there. You go here. Airplane thing can stay there all at once. <laughs> I feel like these two can go here. You can go in that hole. You go there and you can go there. And it's not right. Hmm. Maybe the A and the L got switched? No. Hmm. 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 Maybe it's zero and then counting from highest to lowest. Oh, it was. It was from five to zero. Okay. Well, that got done. And oh, my dear Lord. Okay. We have our mega tackle box over here. <laughs> A lot of bits and bobs. Ew. They make a squishy sound when you pick them up. <laughs> All right. Let's move everything out of these areas because they look like the most weirdly shaped. Oh, yeah. That works. <laughs> Um, okay, let's put our tools here. It's a little knife. We have, what is that? Why does it make that sound? Okay, so let's get all of our tools. Ah, here we go. Little pliers. I feel bad for whatever fish gets this one right here. Would not want to be that fish. You can go over here. Maybe these yellow ones go together. And these all have this little blue stripe on them, so I feel like they might go together. We need something small to go in that corner. Ooh, whatever... No, this doesn't want to go there. You can go there. I feel like we'll put these three here since I do only see three of them. Well, that looks good. And we have all these stray hooks as well. Let's put you in there. Put the chunky one there. Okay. Oh, and that one there. So that's good. So let's put them from here, from biggest to smallest, or I don't know, they kind of look the same. From least complicated pattern to most complicated pattern we'll leave it at that and then these guys can probably go into the neighboring one and then you guys are all together y'all are together i'm sure you guys have to fit together somehow you can stay there you can go under that looks decent that doesn't look good all right we're slowly making this work for ourselves um now we gotta figure this out Let's figure out these worms. They're really gross. Mm, no. That works. And this weird broken one can go here. And then this one goes that. And this goes in the middle. So that's good. Oh boy. Alright. Well, this isn't as bad now that I've figured it out. The only trouble is getting these guys sorted. Slowly figuring it out. I mean, everything looks good to me unless this is, like, off. But it doesn't look off. Maybe this one's not in the center. Oh, yeah, that's what it was. It's a little bit out of its little box. Oh my goodness, he's in a bowl. What a cutie. <laughs> he's so sweet. Mm-hmm. Organizing our button drawer or whatever this is. Okay, so it's just by shape. All right, this one's pretty straightforward, I think, which is nice after that little fishing one. <laughs> and last but not least, boop, yay. Oh, there's different ways of doing it? Really? Oh, this is my sewing drawer. These are the funniest looking scissors I have ever seen. What is this? <laughs> All right, so we have a lot of things here. Where would this go? Probably there. So shoo out everything else. Yeah, that looks like it belongs there. You look like you belong there. We couldn't fold up the measuring tape apparently, so it's just like this now. Or can we? No, apparently we can't. Oh no. Oh, there's more. Okay, well, let's put the goofy looking measuring tape in here. Can enjoy that space there along with that guy. Maybe something else can fit in there later. What is this? Are these broken scissors? Oh no, it's probably for like one hand. Well, you use one hand for scissors, but what is this? Does that make it easier to like cut things? Maybe it's easier to cut things with these scissors. Who knows? Um, let's leave them there for now. Okay, so that looks pretty good for now. Yeah, let's leave it at that. I think that's fine. Also have all of these zippers, all of these other tools. So let's put our tools away. 
they can be organized. And one more. Looks like something big. That would go there. I'm going to put everything in the middle here so I know what we're working with. Oh, this thing. Good. Let's shove our buttons up here. Okay. I don't even know how to approach this. Okay, I feel like this drawer is fine. So we can close that. Forget about it. That part is good. We have our little safety pins with different degrees of being opened. I feel like all the scissors will be together. Maybe we can put zippers in one area. Let's move the buttons. And what more? That looks good. Maybe we can put all of the buttons in one area. So like in these little corners, since we do only have four colors. Yeah, that would make sense. Or at least it'll help it or be organized for the time being. Awesome. A yellow one. There we go. Oh, these poor scissors. Calm down. It's okay. And then we can probably put our thread here and then organize it on some color scheme a little bit later. That looks good. Not looking too good, but we'll leave it at that for now. For now, let me figure out what to do with these guys. It would be good scissors to keep in the middle. Okay. And then, oh, that's funny. I'm aligning it to these little, um, like little wooden patterns in the middle and it works. Yeah, it just kind of snaps into place. These can go here. These look like they belong there. And these wacky looking scissors there. The scissors are good. This section is great. The buttons might need to be changed. This needs to be figured out. Okay, so they want to be there. Good, so that's fine. Not sure too much about the way that is organized. These buttons, however. This one doesn't have two holes on it. Does it join them? I don't think so. Okay, well, let's follow through what I wanted to do was move all of them with three little holes in here and the ones with four into this one. The rest of it looks good. Maybe it's like this. <gasps> That's what it was. Oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm glad that is figured out. Sometimes it's something so small that is not where it's supposed to be and it's so hard to notice it because once everything is organized, it looks pretty good. Let's do these by color so we don't have to rearrange too, too much later. Oh, black ring. Okay. <laughs> Let's move these up a bit. And boom. That should be good for the rings. What is this thing? Looks a little broken. Okay, so we have a lot of pieces here. And we have this little owl down here. How oh, cute. I'm not quite sure. I don't have enough watches or anything to make them all fit really nicely. I feel like I don't have space for all of this. I'm gonna use the hint. So we are missing drawers where activate them to open. It looks like on either side there are two more drawers that are supposed to appear. Maybe it just doesn't open until it's in the correct spot. Oh, what? you are supposed to put them in an order what is the order for this though from like the least sides to the most oh well i feel silly i thought i was just broken <laughs> oh that is clever that is so cool oh well that was definitely my fault <laughs> for not paying attention to this it's like a secret little box how cool i need one more little piece that i don't okay what else am i no nothing there <gasps> This is so cute. Oh my goodness. I feel very silly now. All right, so uh, clearly I don't know how to solve puzzles. <laughs> I think that looks correct. So am I missing a piece? Yes, there we go. Oh no, hold on, close it. Need to move our wonderful cat to the side. Okay, maybe something's off. This looks okay. I don't think any of the other drawers would have opened. Mm, maybe the order of these guys? So they're all facing something? Okay, I see. All right, well, problem resolved. And then we have our cute little kitty that's in the drawer. Oh, what a good little kitty. <laughs> all right, well, let's keep going. Okay, we have this weird sorter thing. Wait, what are we supposed to do with this? Oh, it opens up. What the heck? What is this magical box? What? Do they not actually go in here? They don't fit. Why would I need to do this? Oh, to open them all the way. Okay. That makes more sense. All right. 
This is a cool puzzle. All right. And then this one opens for this guy. I'm glad we can sort our sword collection in here. What was that? Not it? Oops. No. Please go back. Oh, boy. Okay. Put you in here. Were you not going to physically go in here nicely? It should be good. It all closes. It all opens nicely. Yay. There we go. It was just crooked in there. Oh, my. <laughs> are matching everything based on the shape that it is. Can you get out of here for a moment? You as well. Don't think any of these go into the cupboard here. Let's close that. Get this one open. And that one's a bird. So it's this one. Excellent. This one's a light bulb. It's a tree. This one looks like a potato, which I don't have. And then we have a cat. An egg and a cup which we don't have on the side so let's go over here this is the clothes pin this is the apple which is not that it's a whistle this one goes here oh it's a little safety pin no not a safety pin a push pin a thing that i thought was a potato is actually a peanut good to know and then instead of the acorn we put the medicine trophy instead of the egg we put the tape dispenser whistle goes here and acorn goes down there so we can close that put in the apple put in i'm assuming that's a pie close that open this egg mug a little lantern or a pot and then peanut nice there we go that one was fairly straightforward and now we have to organize our cats <laughs> Just so many little compartments. That one goes there, and you would go there, you there, and you right there. Ooh, a little skinny cat. <laughs> These are so cute. You can go in that one. You little stripy cat can fit in there. Chunky monkey goes in there. You there. Well, this one looks like my cat. These two, the little black and white little kitties. Mm. <laughs> a little stretching cat and sitting cat. Yay, we've organized our cats. <laughs> oh, is there a peanut? Hold on, I'm gonna move this to the side just in case we need to put it somewhere. Oh my, just never ending. Oh, let's place our little peanut in. Yay. <laughs> oh, this is different. We have a whole liver, a whole dining room inside of our drawer. <laughs> Okay, let's organize the rug, the table, the two placemats, and they're eating some bread. And then, oh, no, 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 the chair. There we go. Let's see what we have here. Oh, our parking lot. We have an entire parking lot here. Oh my goodness. Oh no. I broke everyone's car. Oh my gosh, stop. Calm down, guys. Calm down. Insurance is never going to cover all the damage that I've done. Mm, move you back, move you here, uh, there. Does that work? Ah, it works. Awesome. Let's see what the next place brings us. A farmland. All right. Hmm. Let's figure out what corner everything goes into. It's so loud. Let's move the road. Can we not move the road? I can't remove the road pieces. Okay. So they're like guiding us to where to put everything else. Got it. Forest stays in the middle. This... Won't be perfect there. You uh, think about it. This goes near the road. That would work fine in the corner. That goes there. This little triangle piece completes that section. You complete that. That goes there. Our little cow field can go here. Here. And last but not least, a little field of crops. Yay. And then drawer number four brings us space. Just pure space of all the things we just organized. <laughs> oh, we completed that. Oh, and with that, we are done with the DLC with the cupboards and drawers. This was cute. A lot of levels were straightforward. Some of them a little bit more difficult. I would say that. <laughs> but this was so cute. Very cozy. Very relaxing. We still get to see our favorite cat friends. <laughs> Oh, our little friend, back in the drawer again. <laughs> Bye, little dude. And that is the end of the Cupboard and Drawers DLC from a little to the left.
I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so, so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!